Jeezy. Okay, awesome. Um, so I got a chance to read some of your, your stuff online. You're a model, broadcaster, radio host, actress. Mm -hmm. Maybe you can tell us what came first. Oh, my God. Uh, well, being a Playmate was first. Uh, then I became Playmate of the Year 2013. And then from there, all the other opportunities came along, which was amazing. Um, I got to host for Black Belt TV, um, hosting for Playboy Radio. Of, and then from there, opportunities just kept coming in, and acting was one of them. And when I got a little taste of acting, I was like, this is where I want to be, so I'm going to stick to this. <laughs> So that leads to the next question. Uh, how has the success of your modeling career influenced some of your work, like the acting, for example? Um, you know what? Huge, because if, if it wasn't for that, I don't think I would be here. I'd be back in a lab <laughs> in San Diego, probably, most likely, or North Carolina. But either one, um, it, it really has changed the path of my life completely. Awesome. So um, being a bi um, uh, sci-fi bio, bio major... Um, maybe you can tell us a little bit about some sci-fi films that you are associated with or that you enjoy watching in the past. Well, coincidentally enough, I was researching about the director of this movie because his name sounded familiar, and he is the same director of the movie Cell with uh, Jennifer Lopez back in, what was it, 90-something. I don't remember the year, to be exact. But that was one of the movies that I truly enjoyed, and I was a, I was a child. I wasn't even a teenager when I watched it, and um, it's something that really interests me because you know somehow, someday it will be possible, but you don't know how, when, or, or, or how fast. So it intrigues my mind. It's like, how can this actually happen? Yeah. <laughs> can we make it happen? How, when? How much will it take? <laughs> so you, do you think there's a sci-fi belief in all of us? Oh, yeah, totally. Absolutely. <laughs> yes. Um, but, I, you know, it depends. There's, I don't know. It, I, I'm not going to say more about that. <laughs> I was going to go into another subject. <laughs> um, have you had a chance to meet any of the cast members of this film? No, actually no, but I am a huge fan of Ryan Reynolds. Who oh, isn't, awesome. right? Yeah, right, right, right. <laughs> Maybe in a summary, sum it up a little bit. What, 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 have you had a chance to see the film? No, I'm going to so watch it today tonight. with okay. everybody, all the fans that are coming out. I'm watching it with them. So without even watching the film, what do you expect? What should, what should um, our viewers um, expect? Amazement, because I don't know if you've had a chance to watch the tra the trailer, but it, it blows your mind. So I, I'm, I'm expecting greatness of this movie pretty much. Awesome. Maybe, okay, oh, great. Thank you very much. Maybe, can you give us a shout-out to our, our Latino School fans out in Chicago and around the country? Yes. It's going to be latinoscoop.com. Okay. Uh, for everyone, -y, everyone, -y. Ah, I can't speak anymore. I'm switching between languages. <laughs> Latinoscoop, right? Latinoscoop.com. For everybody in Latinoscoop.com, uh, this is Raquel Pomplin, and I hope you have a wonderful day. Thank there you go. <laughs> Thank you.